The first phase of the LIA framework is launch. Careful where you're going. It's so dark. It's dark, isn't it? The launch phase harnesses students' science capital by connecting to their real-world experiences. Now, hands up if you've ever been somewhere where there's no light. OK, can you tell me why was there no light? No electricity. No electricity. We rely an awful lot on our electricity, don't we? Yes. I want to talk about what we use electricity for. And what we might do is turn on the light and you'll have the chance to write down your ideas. The shared experience allows students to empathise with people impacted by scientific phenomena and events. What needs electricity? The core concepts and key ideas are planned for and explored in real world contexts. How will people be affected? Diagnostic assessment is used to identify students' prior knowledge and alternative conceptions. I want you to compare all three of them. So you're going to look at what's the same about them, what's different about them. This allows teachers to develop a bridge between what students know and what they will learn. When planning teaching sequences, take an interest in the lives of your students. Their personal experiences, interests, language and communities are connected to the science concepts. By demonstrating that, we show the relevance of science. The launch routines engage students in the science that exists in their world.